Well, a broken collarbone, four broken ribs, and a collapsed lung. Herbert Hoover High School graduate John Stewart continues to throw discus, and he ranked 12th in the nation after a devastating dirt bike accident. Our Shayla Klein reports with his story. I looked at my arms and my left arm, it, it was dislocated and it was like, it looked like a putter head. Josh Stewart doesn't remember exactly how the dirt bike accident happened. He remembers taking a turn too hard in his yard and then waking up on the ground, not being able to move his right arm. And then I tried to get up, so I, I got up and I walked probably 50, 60 feet back towards my house and then I completely blacked out, lost all vision and fell back down on the ground. That's where Josh's stepdad found Josh and called an ambulance. Josh spent a week in the ICU and he had many injuries, including a collapsed lung, four broken ribs and broken neck bones. I had surgery on my right elbow because it broke and I have uh, a plate and nine screws inside of it. It was the summer of Josh's sophomore year and he didn't get to play his freshman year. Track was canceled because of COVID. That fueled Josh's motivation to heal. Now in my mind, I'm thinking I'm never going to throw again. Overcoming all hurdles, Josh was competing in his first track meet five months later. A year later, he ranked 12th in the nation for discus in the AAU Junior Olympics. I was just happy to compete at my state track meet, you know, at the biggest track meet of the year for all high schools is the state meet. Josh's next run, though, is in business. My shop teacher, Coach Meyer, uh, or Tim Meyer, he's inspired me to create my own cabinet shop. So I think me and my brother are working on getting that set up now.